Action. All right. So today we'll be talking about a very important congestion parameter or point, and that is the aortic valve. You can obviously speed this up, right? Don't worry about it. But it's very important to understand um, the importance of obstruction at the level of the aortic valve. So we're going to do the same thing again or no? No. You're good? If you think that's good, I'm on. I don't think it's good because you said the importance of the aortic valve is important because... Oh, did I say that? Yeah. In order to understand obstruction at the level of the aortic valve, Right. It is essential for any intensivist or anyone who takes care of critically ill patients to understand the aortic valve. Identifying these pathologies are very important because it may lead to a, a divergence in the treatment pathway. I keep on saying it's very important. I know, it's, I know. Thick. it's okay. To do this, you have to take a look at the best echocardiographic views to look at the aortic valve. All right, so you've obtained a good view, let's say, of your aortic valve. Now lastly, we also need to have some measure of the aortic valve area. And how do we do this? We do this with the continuity equation. Okay, oh man, man. I have a guy who's crashing. Mm -hmm. I have to resuscitate him. Yeah, okay, I'll do a bedside ultrasound. I'm absolutely required in critical care, right? Right. I, you want me to do equations bedside on a crashing patient yeah. and know these velocities and things? That's a very good point, Karthik. Oh, God. And this is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's, That's going to be so big. That's a very good point, Karthik. <laughs> no, talk to me like you're talking to me. All right, so. You're right, I'm not going to be doing these measurements, and this is not what we're trying to push for. What you really need to try to understand are these basic things.